<laughs> there we go. Bros hugging. What is up, guys? Zach Scott here playing Spider Man 2. Thank you, PlayStation, of course, for the free code for this game. I'm gonna go visit Uncle whatever. Aaron, was it? What is his name? I don't even remember his name. But I'm gonna go visit him. <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember his name. Uh, but uh, he's way far away, so I'm gonna have to swing. New York City is looking great today. Thank you for over 2,000 likes on the first episode. I really do appreciate that a lot. It has over 50,000 views already. And I really don't know like how long this game is gonna be. I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming it's a similar link to uh, the first Spider-Man, so much longer than the Miles Morales Spider-Man that you know came out on the PS5. Uh, but we're heading over here. I might hit a photo opportunity before we get to the main mission. And I don't, I don't know if it's a side quest or a main mission or what. What was that? That was weird. There's a photo opportunity, so let's uh, head over there really quick. There we go. Alright. Excuse me, car. I'm just going to get a quick photo, if you guys don't mind. There we go. Uh, yeah. Okay, I got it, dude. Ah, here we go. Now, I'll admit... I first walked into his shop because of all the articles about his new what flavors. What is this? But his traditional ones would have kept me coming back. Sometimes a classic is a classic for a reason. Get me up here. Sorry, I'm trying to see what this is. This is like a backpack. What is this? What is this? I'm going to check this out. Wrong button. Criminals have stashed tech parts throughout the city. Find them and take them out of the criminal's hands. Stolen underground tech. They try to rebuild themselves without Finn, but I'll put it to better use. Make sure Pete knows about this. Yeah, Pete can figure it out, I guess. Uh, I, I actually, instead of doing the crime, I want to get closer. Oh, shoot. This is, oh, no. Oh, yeah. This is great. Oh, I can't just keep doing that indefinitely, though. Let's get in the jet stream or whatever it's called. There you go. Traversing this game feels amazing sometimes. There we go. I don't know if I could have fast traveled here or what, but I don't mind taking the longer way occasionally. Oh, there's still there's still one down here. Or is there? Is that one? Yeah, there is. Okay, great. It's windy up here, man. And eventually I'm going to try to... Uh, Oh, we're near one of those. Okay, you know what? If we're near one of these, this is this is one of the things that I do want to get done because it seems pretty important to the uh, to the mission. Not my birthday, guys. No need for the surprise. I'm trying to help you out here. All right, let's take this in. Ow. Get him. Oh. Get him, please. It won't work. He's in the water. It can't be good for him. All this trouble for a little crystal. Little Sandman crystal here. Break it open. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. No one has seen Marco in years. I would have been there for him if I knew he was in trouble. I would have not. <laughs> hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. Keep breaking them. Nice. <laughs> okay. Great. Sometimes I worry with all the terrible things that happen in our city. People will be afraid to leave their homes, live their lives. Not today. 
Ooh, this way is where we're going. That was interesting. Goodness, Spider-Man, figure it out. Come on, Miles. All right. I'm like an updraft over here. This place was pretty far away, but we're finally getting over to it. Oh, here's some tech. Do I get tech points for this? Oops. How do I do that? Okay, hold on. <laughs> Sometimes traversing is a little complicated. You get kind of stuck on things. Oh, reminder, skill points available one. Do I want to do the crime or do I want to do... Let's do the crime. The crime is close enough to this objective that I kind of want to do it. Here we go. Just over here. Should have known it'd be both I see you. Sorry, nobody's getting branded today. Nobody. Get it. Get rid of that gun. Get off. Uh oh. This is all part of the prophecy. What do I gotta do now? Oh, uh, you know what? I keep forgetting about the bonus objectives. I was. The hell is wrong with these people? I wasn't even looking at bonus objectives, honestly. I should have been. Level up. So we have some skill points that we can use, and I don't mind, you know, doing the things that are for both of us because that, obviously, I think feels pretty good to get both things going. Uh, let's see. What does this one do? Parry, disarm. If I can actually parry, that will be cool to disarm them. And this one is a uh, R2 to perform a super kinetic loop maneuver. How's that look? For a boost of speed, that could be interesting. All right. A loop to loop. How's that work? Is that it? Did I do it? I don't know. There's some tech up here, but wait. We really got to do this with the mask on? It was Aaron. Yes. Put your mask on. <laughs> Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. <laughs> your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? What? <laughs> Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you got to push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I called. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I got to get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Probably. <laughs> behind us. All right, well, let's see if he's legit. Is he going clean Getting for real? Some? My mask. Did you steal it from me? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Leave it alone. Yeah, yeah. Huh. 
move, birds. <laughs> All right. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. <laughs> okay. I was trying to buy some time in case the, the conversation was going to continue. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you Oh. Did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. So he gave me prowler abilities? Come on. Blocked. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't uh, cheat. Take your time. Wow, the controller is really vibrating. Done. That was cool. Now, back now what? Another gate. Wait, what? All right. Can't pull it open from down here. What? Wait, what? What am I doing? Oh, it needs to go up. Okay. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. I'm in, dude. What do I do? He should return to the Prowler, but be a good guy. Like a totally good guy. Got it. You wanna finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. All right, so I have received a rare tech part Use it to unlock new suits, gadgets, and suit tech. So we have suit tech here, which is uh, important. I can boost your combat and traversal capabilities by upgrading suit tech. Uh, health, yeah, let's boost our health, like for real. <laughs> I've, I've died a couple times. Uh, can I do it again? I can. Health is going up even more. Can I do it again? No, these are unaffordable. I need more tech parts. Okay, great. We're in a good position then. And that, I guess, applies for both of us. Listen. This isn't the only stash. I know. Punk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Now, how Don't many... Stranger. Like, how many are there, like... What gonna say about this? Prowler oh, stashes are Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. I'm okay. Sí, ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Yeah, let's just go find Lee. <laughs> let's just go. Someone's playing with fireworks? Bad idea. What? Rooftop fireworks? Some guys are fooling around with fireworks. Okay, hold what to activate the mission? Call you back in a sec. Fireworks? Call you back in a but second. They're those guys, they're illegal here Those are so permit. far, dude. Before what? someone calls the cops on them. Now, why would I... Wait, hold on. Here's the question. Can I fast travel over there yet? Where? Where is it? Does it show up on here? So, let me see if I can just fast travel over there. That'd be great if I could. Uh, I don't know how. I don't know how to fast. I think I actually have to unlock the district to actually fast travel. That's so far away. Why do I got to go do that right now? The fireworks. Miles, club fair, remember? You on your way? Right. That's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. 
Be there soon. Ow, 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 ow. So Brooklyn Vision's unlocked. Photo op discovered. So what am I gonna do now? Crime reported, I know, I know. Uh, is this something to photograph? That's Shit. perfect for Robbie. What's next? Reminds me of the people who write into the bugle. And a few who work there. Freedom of speech is a beautiful thing. But saying a thing over and over again doesn't make it true. I don't know about that crime over there. So what do they want me to do first? Do I really need to go do this firework thing first? Because that's annoying. Let's see. Let's get ready to fly then. I'm glad they put these like wind streams in here. That's a nice way to handle it. Here we go. I mean, the, the graphics look amazing here, right? I know one's doubting that. They look amazing. I can't believe I'm basically just flying through the city like I'm Superman. I don't really care about the crimes at the moment. <laughs> That's Spider-Man for you. I just want to get over to this. I don't. I, I don't even know what this is. It seems like a side quest or something. And I do want to do the main quests. I think. Oh, Prowler stash discovered. Where? Where? Over here on the top of this building. We'll do that first. I love flying. This is so cool. Uncle Aaron's got a stash here. Better find it. <laughs> All right, where is it? Literally. Hell yeah. All right. <laughs> I can pull that panel out. Circuit box? Guess I'm zapping my way in. Oh, interesting. Okay. How do I do that? How do I zap my way in? Okay, yeah. That didn't open the door, but it activated that first switch? Must be more circuit boxes nearby that activate the rest of them. Oh, great. <laughs> Great, what? More circuit boxes? Okay. There's one here. There's a box. Uh, what was that? Uncle Aaron must have set these on a timer. I'm gonna have to spark each box before it runs out. Oh, come on, dude. What the heck? Where are all this? There's two. I found two. All right. Let me, I guess, find them all. That one ran out as well. And then... All right, there's one. Sorry, this is, they made, there's one, okay. So here, let's do this one. Another one. There's got to be one over here, right? There we go. Yeah. And last but not least, yeah. got some new Prowler stuff. I'm ready. Let's go. It's me. Hmm. All right. Complete. Holy cow, I still hear the sounds. All right. 
Let's go, let's go, let's go. Where are we headed now? Oh, who's that dog? The city seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. So wait. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Now you're really bringing me back here. My very first stash. Why in Queensbridge? The Moon Turtle Arcade. Or at least it used to be before they tore it down and built that skyscraper. Your dad and me basically lived there when we were living. I used to run out of quarters. Whoa! Let me call you back. There's a fire here. What the heck do I do? Stay in there. The more this is going to It's enough! Ow! No guns. They hurt me too much. Get him. There we go. Now I gotta put out the fires. Some fires to put out. Over here. Sorry, sorry. I'm here. I keep forgetting my bonus objectives. Something? The Moon Turtle Arcade. <laughs> or at least it used to be before they tore it down and built that skyscraper. Your dad and me basically lived there when we were little. I used to run out of quarters so fast. But Jay would always spot me some of his. I give anything to go back to that arcade with my big brother. One more time. I miss him. Me too, Aunt. Wish Dad and Uncle Aaron could have made things right before he. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Where am I going? Okay, over here. We still have this. This is a. Uh, this is a rooftop fireworks request. Okay, so if I go do this, what's this over here? This is a. Uh, Side story for the BV Club Fair. And so if I go do this one, I mean, it's not so bad. Which way do I gotta go? Like south or something? Let's go. Is it even marked on the map anymore? It's not. So if I, do I have to like put a waypoint on it? It's, there we go. Let's go this way. I really do like the flying feature of this game. That's really cool. All right. Here we go. Enough of those fireworks. Oh, what? <laughs> Is that them? Let me, let's see if I can get a peek at them up here. Yeah, they're going crazy with the fireworks. Am I just supposed to beat them up or what? Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? Huh? Oh, shoot. He's dead. Frank! He's still breathing, but I'll get him to a hospital. All right, sure. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he going to be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious. But I'm not taking any chances. <laughs> All right, where do I go for the for the hospital? Is there like a uh, over here? Here we go. Here we go. Where am I? Spider-Man. Don't worry. I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you, personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. <laughs> yeah, right. Our brother, Lex. We, we lost him a few years ago, and yeah, yeah, yeah. he always loved them. So we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh man, I'm sorry. <laughs> no excuses. Spider-Man. Wow. Get on here. He's fine. There. His face isn't even burned. Staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy. Maybe you should check where we got them from. 
some docks north of us between those two bridges. Wow. I think I know which place you mean. I'll what take a, a look. What a rat. <laughs> All right. Fine. I'll go look at the fireworks. Hey, Stash. Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. All right, serious guns over here. Let's go. Bro, watch it next to that barrel. <laughs> we can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. Criminal firework enterprise. Miles can camouflage to become invisible when his camouflage meter is full. Uh, it recharges when not in use. How do I do that? Oh, just by pushing up. Cool. Uh, so what do I do? Just like hit him? Boom! All right, that's cool. So I would un uncamouflage. There we go. Let me get my camouflage meter back up so I can do another awesome take down here. Uh, perch take down right there. But I would need to. I could take this guy out. Look at me now, ma. Can I do it? Can I do it? It's up, right? There we go. Perch take down this guy. Boom! Oh, somehow still alive after all that. Uh, let's get rid of it. Let, let it recharge for a little bit. Who else are we looking at here? Oh, he found it. He found a guy. All right. Uh. Got him. Who else is left here? That guy's big and bad. Uh. Hey guys. Whoops. I just wanted to warn you about some shady characters selling bad. Yo, wait a second. Spiders here. Call the boy. We ain't losing the ship. Here you go. Ow. Dang. Oh, shoot. I know. Parry, right? Oh, shoot. God dang it, dude. I, I know. I know. This is not great for me. I'm trying to heal. All right, uh. Got him. I'm hurt still. The fireworks, they're lit. Uh, the river, I can chuck them. Into the river. Nice. That guy up there has a perfect view. Two more. Throw him up at that guy. Okay, last crate. Oh, I'm, wait, I'm supposed to stop them? Nice. Beautiful. Wow, really nice. Happy birthday, Lex. <laughs> Was that you? Oh, man. I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. All right, rooftop fireworks complete. What are we really doing though? We're looking at this app, healing the world, be the book. This is like a real actual thing that we need to do. So let's, this one is just like a side mission, make it to the school club fair on time. Uh, let's do, let's do this one. This one requires Peter, so let's go ahead and switch to Peter. We'll get some Peter action in here. <laughs> what, am I okay? Hey, Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. 
some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Oh. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. <laughs> I'm basically soaring across the water here. It's great. All right, what are we gonna take a picture of? I always hit that. I don't mean to. That should work for Robbie. <laughs> say what you will about social media, and I can say a lot. It's helped so many businesses stay afloat here when they would have gone under a long time ago. All right. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. We don't want to join you. All right, so I love just coming in here, starting off strong. Boom! How about you point that thing towards me? <laughs> Bonus gadget shot. Gotcha. Oh, I always forget about the freaking bonus thing. To brand people out in the open. Call this one an audience for this. Kind of weird, honestly. All right, so there is a fire thing we got to do. Do we do it first, or do we? I don't know. Let's go ahead and go over to this. This mission's closer. Oh, something over here. Where is it? I'm I'm ready to look. Where where is this need to be? A chess game. All right, over here then. You know, I saw an old grandmaster playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who <laughs> Just hang up. We're at the uh, Emily May Foundation. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Beautiful tree. This tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. So, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> so true. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. I mean, this place is amazing. Can I work here instead of being a teacher? Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh, really? But I was gonna give him a tour, let him Decide for himself. All right. <laughs> you know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. <laughs> Have fun. Get your badge out. 
let's go exploring. Oh yeah, he gave me that badge. <laughs> this place looks pretty sweet. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. Sure. How did you? I got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is. Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Hmm. It's a big old bee place. Yes, Gene. I just checked out. So this place, I mean, wow. I don't even know what to say. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Sure. Let's chat. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. Hello. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full Whoa. third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline. Primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna we kill all the bee wolves. Bee drones. Heck yeah. This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. <laughs> we're gonna take him out. Nice. Yes. I'm too good at this. Let me at him. I'll destroy all the bee wolves in the world. Let me shoot shoot these people too. Boom, boom, you're dead too. You hear that little bee wolf? You still get to I, I'm not allowed to crash it. You gotta protect the hive. Nice. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay. Flying Excellent. Home. Flying to these guys again. <laughs> Pretty sweet, dude. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. It's a lot of wow. bees. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I mean, I just need a job that I, I can so leave from at any time. Let's go. <laughs> That's what kind of job I need. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting edge proton beam work using protons instead of x-rays with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. Heal the, the world. Make it a better place. <laughs> we already know he's an MJ fan. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter Where'd he put his Dr. arm? Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. <laughs> it's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I've never been better. He's having impulsive thoughts about MJ, I can tell you that. Nice to see you again. He probably doesn't recognize me because my face is way different than when I last saw him. Your doctor is the wizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that, that, wait, that was the lizard? So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. 
Look at all these plants. Boring. What are you looking at? They're boring. All right. Computers, let's That's game. Precisely the issue. The so much to see here. Recalibration. Where do I even start? This thing's flashing. Let's look at that. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. This is a. The uh, origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? From God. Hello. What else is there? Is this a salad bar? Oh, no. This is a bunch more rocks. What else are we going to look for? Okay, over here we got a couple more kiosks. There's a computer over here. I don't know how much stuff I actually have to look at. This looks interesting. Little uh, arm here. What was this? Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Oh, hey. Dr. Connors has used this. He needs a new arm. And after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. I mean, probably Dr. Connors or something. I don't know, man. He needs that arm, dude. Give him... Oh, jeez. Gosh, dang it, dude. That scared me so much. <laughs> I don't know why. It was just so creepy. All right, let's go look at this thing, then. Uh, there's a few computers over here. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. <laughs> oh, no, nope. <laughs> Can't wait till you see what they used for his treatment. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Let me tinker with something else. Oh, yeah, Let me that would take a while. make some HIPAA violations I'm not here. Sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. For sure. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. The All right. For medical organ I like it. Far out numbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology. Innovative solution is we harvest organs from prisoners. <laughs> so no. All right, here we go. What's going on over here? Oh, this is the B girl. Drone. Boo. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Okay. Show complex group decision making and group locomotion. All right, let's just kind of go this way. We'll meet him back at wherever he wants me to meet him, I think. What's going on over here? Hello, you need up your bike. Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? Nosy. We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes. What is that sound? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Thanks, nice. Dr. Wynn. I'll try to come back. He's like, can I ride that bike right now? She's like, no, I'm busy. Where's Harry? Oh, up, up the stairs, I guess. There's a lot to look at. Should I like look at everything or I should just go, right? Probably. Oh, I don't know. Let's get up. Well, I, well, hold on. There's something. It's, it's caught my eye. Let me look at it really quick. I wish I could walk faster. There's so much to explore. I know. I, I you shouldn't keep Harry waiting. I know, but maybe you should because there's so much to explore, like you said. Was this thing flashing before? What is this? I already looked at this, didn't I? Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. <laughs> All right, I don't, don't see anything. Okay, let me just go upstairs. My bad. I know softball. Softball's happening. Don't wor don't forget about it. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Like I said, start paying off the mortgage. Yeah, and you might. But what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. He really just needs to figure out how to monetize Spider-Man, dude. 
That's the main problem. He's trying to do all this science. He's trying to do teaching. Blah. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. I'm impressed. Incredible. All right, so now what? Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. Yes. Middle school. Okay. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. Now, do you know the... Stuff. Hang on. Sorry. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gribor Mendel and the pea plants? No. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. It's so calming and... We're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. Sorry, I mean, you, I didn't want to leave you waiting. I could have s wasted some time feeding fish, I guess. The algorithm is similar to long division, if you look at it that way. All right, well, this place is sweet, dude. I do want to work here. They should just let me work here. No commitments, though. Can't commit this way, to dude. I'm right here, dude. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Sure. <laughs> okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. There we go. Look what I made. I made this plant. I'm okay. so cool. I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This really? is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Interesting. Did I do it right? I guess so. Okay, okay. I'm getting it. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Hmm. That one doesn't go there. Or this one doesn't go there. Uh, yeah, I know. I'll switch them out, dude. Let me... Okay. Sorry. Um, let's try the water here. Nope, that doesn't work either. So maybe... Let's see. I know, I know. It's terrible. Let's see what we got. Put this here. Put this there. Put this there. Put this there. There we go. I think I got it this time. Beautiful work, Peter. Thank you. Cool. All about that plant Using life. Using this technology... We're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. You don't have a rooftop here? Thank you, Dr. Foster. <laughs> so now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Ooh, Harry, good. now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not until you've seen this last thing. Okay. 
Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. All right, so now we're gonna go see our office. Why don't we each have like our own office though, like for real? Like, what do we gotta share? Go ahead. Swipe. Oh, this does look pretty cool though. I kind of don't want windows everywhere. I don't want people to watch me. <laughs> wow. He's even got pizza, old pizza. Aw. Tugging on my heartstrings. Man. Harry. This is this is uh, emotional abuse. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just things are really hectic right now. Dude, don't turn this down. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> oh, come on. Flattery. Come on. Let's make my mom and May proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. I'm Spider-Man. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Bros hugging. Oh, one quick thing. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, computer. Oh my god, my cell phone is going crazy, dude. I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Like six weeks. Of course. <laughs> Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. This guy seems like a good guy, but something's gonna go wrong. <laughs> I just know it. All right. <laughs> I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. Of course if they do. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. It says I can afford to switch. Okay, hey, hold on. sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? <laughs> yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right, good luck out there. All right, well. Well, well, well. That was an exciting episode. I had a lot of fun. It was pretty informative. I love exploring like museums or corporate offices in video games i really do i'm not that sounds sarcastic but it's true like in the last of us 2 and stuff like that uh, but hey thanks for watching oh crime reported arson no big deal come back next time for some more spider-man 2 i'm zach scott subscribe if you have not if you like this video and want to help the channel grow all you got to do is click the like button below thank you so much for watching you can now join on youtube and become an official member of zach scott games and if you want cool shirts like this visit zach scott dot shop. Come back next time for more.